already did a leak search on. It's leaking over in the bottom somewhere. But, uh, should be pretty easy. We'll take that in and out. No, no, it's good. I see it's co I, see, I ain't know it's copper. That other one was aluminum. Oh. So the copper gonna be a lot better. Oh, okay. Yeah, that aluminum. It don't last long. That'll last hopefully a while. That's good. That aluminum don't last long. Yeah, we always have a problem about them aluminum cores leaking. A lot of times, see, when them aluminum cores leak, you can't fix it because it's hard to braze and mm -hmm. solder it. But if this ever leak, you can fix it. Oh, okay. you can, yeah, you can braise it. Yeah. <laughs> yes, sir. All right, folks, so I think it's completely dry. I'm gonna go ahead and crack this just to see. Crack that right there, or just sweat it out right here. Completely empty.
I got a new field so I'm going to put in there when you get it. Okay. Right. Okay. this bow right here and uh, I can cut this one about right here and this should be fine
So I turn it several times, tighten up, turn, tighten, turn. Sweat these out or cut them out. A lot of times it's best to just cut them out so you won't contaminate your system. So I thought I was filming me taking it out, but I had it on taking a picture mode. But this is the old core. Uh oh, let's see. Let's see what the rooster talking about. Up early in the morning before the rooster crow. Y'all got that on film? Y'all see that rooster crow? We already out here getting it. Hey, rooster. Hey, you late, man. Early bird get the worm. Early bird get the worm, Mr. Chicken. All right, folks, let's put this new coil in. All right, folks, so there should be some pressure on here. I think I better go ahead and release this. I'm gonna release this pressure and cut this.
almost perfect. That's about perfect there, folks. So I'm gonna get my swagger too. I'm gonna uh, probably cut this one down to about right here. And we'll swage this and stick this in here. coupling on here I'm gonna have to ream this one a little bit so I'll probably do the, the top of this one oh no though I'm sure I'm to put my drain line first. So hopefully I can get a coupling on there. This will set you back. Alright, so I think that's good. It's a little piece of wood right here.
this and hope it not. We'll put a little bit in there for now. Let's put about 20 PSI. If it start decreasing rapidly, we know we got a leak. back up. Put my ball like this. Fill this up to about 200 psi, let it sit for about 10 minutes and I'll pull it back. Alright. Alright, so we got about 200. I'll select this device, pressure and temperature. 204, folks. So I'll let that marinate for about 10 minutes and then I'll go ahead and pull my back. So I'm going to get cleaned up. We out of here. All right, gonna blast off the bullet. Two stage vacuum pump. This is a 7 CFM. Four ten a 91 ounces. So I just do 91 divided by 16. So I'm gonna weigh in exactly five point seven ounces of 410A refrigerator. This as a liquid, let it rip. Let it rip. Look at the 
See if we can get it all in there. Let's hold it. All right, so I'm gonna slow it up right here. I do not know how to put this right here back on. I gotta figure this out. Oh, figure that out. All right, father, turn it on. See what it'll do. at the 14 a the yellow jacket switched over to another application I haven't used it in a while I usually use a man tooth app but I think they discontinued it
All right, folks, so I got this pretty much dialed in where I want it. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, wrap this one up. Uh, today is Tuesday, and we fit to have some bad storms come through here Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday. And I have this uh, five ton, I think it's a, yeah, five ton or a seven and a half ton train uh, package unit. I think it's a president unit. Uh, that I need to get up on the roof and uh, replace this coil. So I'm thinking about doing that today. I was gonna change this about for the coil out and just run uh, service calls today. Uh, but uh, I haven't got any call yet this morning, so I think I'm gonna go ahead and try to put this compressor in today so I can beat that weather. But we'll see. All right. As always, y'all, thanks for watching. WWH back. Get down to like 70, get a soft on 50 in my 